Alex Thompson shares the same middle name with her mother. We'll get back to that name in a moment. Whether out on the field or inside the gym at Hewitt Trustville Middle School, Alex is always cheering for her team. But last November, her team began cheering for her. It started out just thinking that it was like a stomach virus or the flu, and then all of a sudden it became this like life altering. Alex was diagnosed with a vascular brain tumor. Despite being non-cancerous, her parents Ross and Ingrid, both registered nurses, knew the high risks involved. You know, your world comes crashing down at that point. A very emotional time. Little did I know through the whole ordeal, I mean, she was going to be the one that showed all the strength. You know, and uh, I drew strength from her. My wife drew strength from her. As soon as Alex came out of not one, not two, but three surgeries at Children's Hospital of Alabama, she quickly started down the road to recovery. Fortunately, she wasn't alone. It just meant a lot, all the support I had from my friends and family and church and school teams. Here at school, we started taking up money and donations and people started selling shirts and wristbands just to, you know, help support the family. She also got plenty of phone calls while in the hospital, one that came as a very big surprise. We put AJ McCarron on the phone and I was hooked up to all the um, machines and everything and my heart rate starts going up and everything beating. I was so nervous. Alex later got an invitation to meet the Alabama football team just before their trip to Miami for the national championship game. It really meant a lot for them to take time out of their weekend and out of them hanging out and everything for them to call me and talk to me and encourage me and tell me everything was going to be okay. They told me that they would be thinking about me during their game and playing for me. Then it was Alex's turn to begin preparing for her debut on the national stage. We took it day by day. I started out just walking to the mailbox and back and then to the stop sign and back and stuff. Around my birthday, January 14th, I started going, trying to go back to tumbling. I started going back to your practice because I wanted to be there for nationals. And I didn't, um, I did do some tumbling at nationals. So that was three months after surgery. Now seven months has passed as Alex continues to live her life of hope. Hope is also the middle name given to her at birth, which has taken on a much deeper meaning for Alex. And the many lives she has touched with her spirit. Let's go, let's In Trustville, Lauren Sisler, CBS 42 Sports.